Hi Pisces and welcome to your General Energies Tarot Forecast. This is for the second half of February. I'm going to start off by pulling a card to see what your energy is for the rest of February. Who is Pisces? Alright, let's see. Ooh, we got the dog, friend. So Pisces, you are extending your beautiful and loving energy to one or many over the rest of February, okay? This says, today I will love without condition. My energy and enthusiasm are an inspiration. I choose to be happy. I am a protector and friend. So Pisces, um, because this is your energy, you are really having somebody's back. You are really protecting somebody. Um, you're really supporting somebody. You're really being there. You're going out of your way. Um, a lot of people could be looking to you uh, for your light or, you know, it's just for whatever reason, this next two weeks of February, people are letting you know how much of an amazing friend, support system, you know, guide, counselor, nurturer, healer, friend, sister, brother, mother, lover, whatever you are. Like it's, there's Pisces where there you're really being told, you're really being shown um, with gratitude and appreciation by other people for what you've done for them or what you've been to them, you know, and this could be a multitude of people or this could be one very specific person. All right. Um, but Pisces, it's like you are the glue. You are the support system um, for one or many for the rest of February. Kind of leading the pack, so to speak. So I'm going to pull a couple of soul cards uh, to get more insight. And these do not have a name, nor do they have any description that comes with them. They're just for uh, you to, you know, intuit. For me to intuit through the reading and then you as the viewer to also, what, what do you get from them? So, let's uh, see you, Pisces. Okay, ooh, so you guys got spirit coming on in. Um, I love it. I believe that I saw this in Sagittarius. It was either Sagittarius or Capricorn. And um, this, to me, is where, you know, here is spirit coming in to do some healing. And... Pisces, because you are coming through as the friend, it's like spirit is coming to work through you to help other people. One specific person, multiple people, um, a situation, just there's something where spirit is definitely working through Pisces these next two weeks. And you're going to feel that. Wow. Yeah, look at that. Now we have this partnership, this union, this support between two people surrounded by all of this... Um, green, which green is heart chakra. It's love. So Pisces, couple of things I'm seeing here. Um, this is just a reiteration of the message I gave about you being this incredible uh, beacon of light, pillar of support, um, you know, healer with love, caring, concern. I don't know. Like there's just some part of you with a person or somewhere in your life where you are just spirit is just flowing, flowing through you, okay? Others of you, this could definitely be a period where you and a friend that maybe have had a falling out, you and a family member, um, you and a, like, ex-lover, you and somebody else who have been on the outs with each other, this is spirit coming in, healing the two energies and realigning you back into heart space connection, okay? Um, whether that is just happening energetically at a spirit level because we do have our backs turned here or that's where we're having a full on healing all the way into the physical realm where we're communicating we're having conversations there's apologies there's clearing of the air you know different things like that also pisces you could be the mediator between two people um, this next two weeks where you're really trying to help two people understand each other, heal each other, you know, come back into alignment with each other. So let's, uh, let's pull some more cards, Pisces, and see what else comes out. All right. 
The answer is yes on the bottom. Okay, so ooh, we got a union. Um, yeah, and that really coincides with that energy. But to me, again, this is just a, a confirmation of all I've said, whether this is, you know, a reunitement with a lover, a friend, a family member, where we're finally kissing and making up and clearing the air, or we're just being really supportive to um, another person. But again, spirit, this is spirit's hand at play. Wow. Next card out is recognition. So... It, to me, this is a confirmation of where there's some Pisces out there that, you know, people are going to be telling you how amazing you are and, you know, thank you for this Pisces, you're a rock in my life, you're this, you're that, I wouldn't have never made it through, like, you're all these wonderful things. So some of you, this is that recognition, but um, those of you where there is is a potential reconciliation of some kind, um, with a connection, this is where they are letting you know, Pisces, um, how much they miss you, how much you are truly amazing, how much you, you know, their life is different um, when you're not around, like things like that. So right away, Pisces, these are um, great cards for you. This could also be in the workplace, Pisces, where you are really being recognized this next two weeks at some point. Understanding, um, Okay, so that goes really well with reconciliations, right? Also, um, the you being the mediator for some people, you're going to definitely bring them into a, an understanding, a reconnection, because no matter how this reading is speaking to you, Pisces, Spirit's hand is moving the energy for you guys this next two weeks. Observer, and this is under union. So those of you where this is like somebody coming back in, to your life or you are deciding to try to get back into somebody else's life, um, they've definitely been watching you, observing you somehow, some way, whether through social media, whether this is in the workplace, at uh, some sort of educational institution, just wherever this is playing out for you, um, involving another person um, trying to come back in or you will wish to be back in their life, Pisces, they're watching you. They're, they're not far away from you, okay? They check in on you occasionally and they really do desire this reconciliation. Also, um, this to me goes back observer and recognition where there's, you know, you're being honored and recognized and appreciated in some area of your life by somebody um, saying, you know, Pisces, you're amazing, you're this, you're that, and the other. And again, that spirit not only working through you, but also working through that other person to let you know, Pisces, that, you know, you're doing what you need to do. Wow. And now look at this tribe. Are you kidding me? And next out, new direction. Yep. Um, oh, Pisces. <clears throat> You are just helping. I, I mean, uh, let me just get them all out. Okay, third party. Reinvention. And pride and ego. Pisces. Yes. Uh, again, this is where you are really helping somebody, supporting somebody through some sort of transition, um, being a really good friend, being a healer, being a nurturer, um, just saving the day, okay? Um, also, somebody trying to come back in your world or you trying to get back into somebody else's world, there was some deception, some betrayal, misunderstanding, something with this third-party energy, and there's been a lot of ego involved that's kept, you know, a barrier but there's reinvention and new direction. So it's like your stuff just keeps repeating, okay, throughout the reading. We have recognition and observer, and now we have new direction and reinvention. So that to me is like big time confirmation, Pisces, that um, where you were not being appreciated, now you are going to be. Um, where somebody was shady in the past, they have done a lot of work in themselves and they want to, you know, make things right or they've come to new conclusions and they want to clear the air with you. Um, those of you where you're kind of mediating and just being a very supportive, you, I think, are helping somebody come into a brand new understanding, shift in perception about what's going on in their life or what their options are. Like, you're just instrumental to somebody or a group of somebody's uh, this last two weeks of 
February. It's like you're saving the day somehow, some way. And with third party, again, that's that where you are in the middle. You are trying to mediate between two energies and bring balance, bring peace, bring harmony, bring happiness, restore balance to the tribe, okay? Because I don't feel like... Um, Anybody involved in this reading, Pisces, is not part of your people. If we've had a falling out, if we're having friction, we're having misunderstanding, some bad things could have happened in the past. This is still your people. It's part of your tribe, your soul tribe, okay? Um, it could, and again, this could be in the workplace. This could be in your family. This could be in your friend circle. This could be in any sort of like group or or extracurricular activity or hobby that you're involved with. If you, um, you know, volunteer your time at like an animal shelter, a hospital, just whatever, Pisces, you are really saving the day um, this last two weeks for somebody, some Pisces out there. Others of you, it's in one of those places where you're being incredibly recognized. Or again, Pisces, you're just kind of in the middle, keeping peace, restoring balance to the tribe for everybody. And there, you have nothing to gain or lose from it. You're just doing it because that's who you are. Um, okay, that's just who you are. But anybody coming back into your life this next two weeks, Pisces, um, they've really had a change of heart and of energy and of consciousness. Wow. Yeah, look at that. These two cards flew out. A seven of swords. That's the deceptive energy. But now it sits by the emperor and, you know, um, this is taking accountability. This is being incredibly responsible. So Pisces, anybody trying to come back in, they definitely have changed and they've been watching you from afar. Maybe you've been watching them from afar. Oh my God. Yeah. And look at, as I'm saying that these two cards just fly out the fool and the ace of cups. They definitely want a new beginning with you. Pisces like so bad, but maybe their pride and ego is kind of a factor. Huh. And as I say that, the Knight of Wands flies out. Yes, Pisces, their pride and ego may be a factor and very well could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. But look at this, Seven of Cups. They think about you. They fantasize about you. Um, they watch you from afar. Or, Pisces, you can reverse all of this and this could be you and how you're feeling, um, you know, towards a fire sign. Doesn't have to be, but just saying... So let's get some clarity on these cards, Pisces. All right, so we have the Knight of Chalice, and that's on Union, okay? So yeah, that's uh, something being offered to Pisces, an apology, a compliment, sweetness, all of those lovely things. Under recognition, we have the Four of Cups, and you want to know what that tells me? This is where Pisces has not been recognized and properly appreciated in the past, but now this next two weeks, there is recognition for Pisces also, because this is general. Pisces, this could be you, where you weren't, you know, recognizing somebody for their true value in your life and you finally are. I don't think that's the case because you're coming out as this energy, but just have to put that out there since this is general. And look at this. We have the death card on the understanding. So um, to me, that's completely transformational energy, which sits right above new direction. And then we have reinvention. So anybody trying to come back into your world, Pisces, they're a different person. Um, or if you're really trying to get back in somebody's world, you have changed quite a bit, all right? Um, those of you being supportive, uh, it could be, you know, somebody has just really been through a bunch of crap, and you're the thing that got them through, Pisces. Wow. Under Observer, look at this. We have the Herophant. Um, so the reason why, if this is somebody that's still checking in on you, watching you from afar, is because they feel a very strong soul connection to you. I'm not surprised with Tribe. Yeah, look at that. Six of Wands. That's connection. That's harmony. That's in the spotlight. That's, you know, real good energy. Under New Direction, we have Temperance. Nice. So there's a balance there's been a shift under third party we have the nine of pentacles and you want to know what this to me is speaking about this third party energy how <clears throat> it was deceptive and unreliable <clears throat> in the past all of that has changed it is now a very steady slow stable 
reliable energy under reinvention. We have the Three of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody's been doing some work, okay? Um, also, Pisces, this is where I'm seeing you being the mediator between two people or, you know, being some sort of leader or guide in a group where you're really shifting energy, restoring balance. I mean, we have the temperance card here. Yeah, Pisces, that's the restoration of balance and harmony to a relationship or situation. And look at this, the world card on pride and ego. That is out the door. I love it, Pisces. Yes. This is a great reading for you guys. I'm just trying to see... Um, what to clarify I, I almost don't feel like I need to but you know I, I did pull clarity cards uh, for all the other signs so I will do so for you um, but yeah it looks pretty straight simple and forward Pisces um, you're being recognized honored valued appreciated um, somebody's trying to come back in and you know tell you how amazing you truly are they want to forget the past like a complete transformation of energy others of you it's just like you you are the support system keeping something together and um, people are really counting on you you're just out in the spotlight um, you know being a hero being a beacon of light being the peacemaker being the mediator whatever that is for you Pisces and you are successful in that okay because spirit again is working through you to restore balance and harmony within your own relationship or within um, some sort of situation or relationship involving other people and as I'm saying that yeah look at that five of cups and the justice card this is you know um, a balancing because justice is balanced right to the sadness of energy you know the restoration harmony is restored so let's see um, let's take a look at the observer why is that I mean I, I already know why but you know, it's just always fun to dig deeper, right? So let's see what's going on over here. Also, with the Observer and the Herophant, um, that, that is like in the workplace for sure, Pisces, that somebody higher up has noticed you and um, all all that you do. And, you know, for some of you, this could even be where you were going to like put in your notice um, to like just outright quit the job or... Um, move on to a new job and in doing so it's like oh my god no Pisces don't don't do it don't go what is it that we need to do okay so look at that we have the king of cups we have the temperance card again and the ace of cups are you kidding me um <laughs> yeah so Pisces, anybody who is still observing your you, looking at your social media, um, watching you from afar, could be a Sagittarius, could be a fellow water sign um, with these two energies, doesn't have to be, just saying. Um, they want a new beginning. They still have feelings for you. They hope that, you know, you guys can clear the air, move beyond whatever this is. Or, Pisces, if this is your energy, this is truly what's in your heart. You desire balance and harmony and flow and a second chance. Let's do this again. Let's, you know, start over. Um, but uh, for those of you that this is in the workplace or, like, educational institution, something like that, Pisces, you're really being noticed for your ability to handle things, to properly delegate, to manage, to help your fellow teammates, co-workers. Like, you're just really being praised and noticed um, these last two weeks for sure. So let's... Um, Let's come over here to New Direction and Temperance since, you know, we had Temperance come out over on this side as well. There's that Six of Wands again. Yeah, Pisces, I think balance, harmony, love, all of that is being restored for you in some way or you are truly helping restore that for somebody else or for a situation. So we have the Six of Wands again. That's Pisces out in the spotlight. We have the Seven of Wands. And oh my gosh, we have the World card again. Pisces, yeah, it's just duplicates for you guys, all right? Um, so 
we have the reinvention with the new direction, the recognition with the observer, with the Hierophant on top of that, um, and then we have the Six of Wands twice, we have the World card twice, and we have the Temperance card twice, okay? Temperance is balancing, harmony, restoration, energies finally, you know, coming into alignment. So it's the world card, the end of a cycle, the completion of some heavy energy, a uh, seven of sword or seven of wands where you're feeling defensive, like you need to protect yourself or there's just too much coming at you. It's finally balanced to all that energy or you're offering that balance to somebody else. Or, you know, if this has been like, um, about a relationship specifically, Pisces, I really feel there is some sort of healing coming in, like Spirit's hand is at play for sure. So let's pull you some advice. Oh, okay, we'll do that shuffle again. Oh, look at that. Second chances, Pisces. That is what I'm going to call this, second chances. Whether you're helping somebody get a second chance, um, you're mediating between two people, it's a second chance um, for you somehow, some way. Um, un, uh, what does this say? Unselfishness will renew you. Um, I don't feel like that's so much Pisces energy because, again, you're coming out as the dog. I feel like that is um, the energy that is being tempered okay, that you're helping temper, or that you have been tempering, um, you haven't been a selfish person, you've really been going out of your way here, and now it's all coming back to you, you're being recognized, honored, rewarded, you're out in the spotlight, my god, you got the six of uh, wands times two, okay, and to me, the world card, it's the end of heavy energy, because you also have the death card, so that's ending, ending, ending. You have ending times three, okay? Um, and you have all of these duplicating messages, which I haven't had in the other readings. So, Pisces, there is some magic at hand, and your spirit guide messages was magic times three, okay? So, this last half of February, Pisces, there's just something amazing going on for you. You're really keeping it together. You've been great um, along this journey and spirit is totally working through you and there's balance, restoration, temperance, harmony um, playing out in your world or you are very instrumental in that process for somebody else or some situation. Okay, so um, all about second chances though, Pisces. All about second chances, okay? Somehow, some way, um, that's just the theme here. So anyways, I will leave it with that and wish you all the best. Take care.